Well, a special feel in this arena tonight for more reasons than one, but of course, the centerpiece is the former two-division UFC champion, the future Hall of Famer, Conor McGregor, returning to the proven ground here tonight. He fought three times in 2016, just once in 2018. Everybody's excited to see what version of Conor McGregor shows up here tonight. There are more Irish flags in the building uh -huh. than you'll find anywhere in the United States of America. Uh -huh. And it's all for the notorious one. Conor McGregor has taken his country put it on his back and rode it to superstardom. He is a fantastic fighter, has really good takedown defense, which allows him to keep the fights on the feet where guys are always in danger. You're constantly in danger whenever you're fighting Conor McGregor because the moment you attack, that counter left hand is like a piston and he can shut your lights out with one strike. Yeah, that McGregor counter left hand, truly one of the best weapons in mixed martial arts today. A master when it comes to movement and distance management and also just rising to the occasion, right? When all eyeballs are on him, and you've experienced this as well, the ability on fight night to shine. All the distractions, Connor is able to shut them out, and he goes into the octagon, is focused, and always gets the job done. Connor McGregor, always ready to engage. We'll see how he handles this challenge. Here we go, Sugar Sean O'Malley, and you can argue a lot of these people in the building tonight are here to see him. You can argue, though, this is his stiffest challenge in the UFC. I believe so. I believe this is the toughest one. And I know he's fought Piotr Jan, the former champion. I know he's fought Pedro Munoz, but this opponent tonight is going to push him in ways that he has not been pushed before. Does Sean O'Malley use his fantastic footwork, his speed, and his mind to set enough traps to get the victory? I guess we'll see very shortly. Well, you all know the judges are looking for damage and moments of damage, and Sean O'Malley has been pretty good at providing those over the last several years in the UFC. Sugar Sean O'Malley set to fight the notorious Conor McGregor. the tape for this heavyweight fight. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Herb Dean, third man in the octagon tonight. While Sean O'Malley has been a notorious fast starter in the UFC thus far, it is something his corner has prioritized once again here tonight. Let's see if O'Malley can lead the dance and dictate the pace here. Early. While few fighters manage distance as efficiently and as well as Conor McGregor, and there's that left hand finding its home early. Oh, he does a great job of setting you up, man. You saw it in the Jose Aldo fight. The guy will just step back a little bit and bang, drops the straight left on you that can end your night. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, and there is the kick. That one checked by Sean O'Malley. Oh, solid kick right there. So more output, at least in the early going. That team. Strong 
Some straight left there. Man, this is wild. If you like offense, these fighters are going at it. All gas, no brakes, baby. Let's go. Oh! Big left hand. Leg kick checked effectively there by McGregor. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Conor McGregor. Oh, high amplitude head kick! He got him again with the kick. That was beautiful. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Just over three minutes to go. He tags him with the straight. Nice job there by O'Malley. Another punch to the head. Oh, These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. Well, everybody wants a piece of Conor McGregor, of course, including his opponent here tonight. But what else can you say about McGregor's ability to manage his time and everything that has been asked of him since he vaulted to not just MMA superstardom, but A-list celebrity status? Pretty interesting to see him mixing it up with the kicks here, some calf kicks, and now attacking the thigh effectively. Just throwing a traditional leg kick. The traditional leg kick was a little higher. Everybody wants to talk about that calf kick right now. There's still a lot can be done. Tonight, as he pounds him out for the TKO, I'm hoping I get an invite to the afterpart. <laughs> now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 58 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO, the notorious Conor McGregor! So what a moment for the biggest superstar this sport has ever seen. Conor McGregor, your winner by TKO. Beautiful performance by McGregor. He did... PlayStation.